Sunday is critical Sunday night because we have a total lunar eclipse and they occur about every three years or so but this could be really quite spectacular and I want to bring in Jeffrey Chester here Jeffrey thanks for having us out here my pleasure so let's talk about the phases you have to kind of stay up a little bit late, a little late uh, but yeah, not too yeah, crazy not late too on Sunday so let's go through uh, some of the phases of the uh, eclipse well eclipses lunar eclipses have a couple of phases the first one is the penumbral phase which really doesn't amount to much that's when the moon starts to enter the edge of the earth's kind of peripheral shadow that will be at 9 30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time okay. uh, it enters the umbral or central part of the Earth's shadow at 10:27 p.m. Uh, and then at I got to use my cheat sheet here. That's a good time. Uh, right, right. That's the good stuff. Right. And then at 11:28 p.m. it is completely immersed in the earth's shadow. And it will then take uh, about an hour uh, and a half to cross through the entirety of the earth's shadow. Uh, it will start to come out at 12.54 a.m. Okay. Uh, it will leave the umbral shadow at 1.55 a.m. And then if you want to stay up and watch the end of the penumbral phase, uh, that's 2.55 a.m., but there really won't be that much to see. Okay. Okay. Well, Jeffrey, thank you. You're the public uh, affairs officer. Thanks for having us out here. And let's just hope we can just get a little bit of clearing. We're going to have some storms come in on Sunday, and then maybe Sunday night we'll have a little window uh, of clearing. So uh, let's go to the graphics for a second. We'll go through the phases again. So really, it's the best time in terms to watch would be, you know, I would say, you know, 11:30 to maybe 12:30 if you want to see uh, the the best phases. But then it will go out uh, pretty soon. But this is going to be fantastic. 12:12 12, 12 is pretty much a, a peak eclipse time. So hopefully we'll be clear at about 12:12. 12, 12. And then by the time we get to a 2:30, it's totally out of the penumbra uh, shadow. You won't be able to see anything there. But we don't need three hours of clear skies. We need about an hour at the right times. That's that's the key.